Hello, people. How are thou? Okay, so I was on the Hub de la Porn. Yes, Porn Hub. So, and I noticed something. <laughs> I had to laugh. You know why I'm laughing? Because of what I noticed. Who the hell put this goddamn ladder here? Anyway, so this is what I noticed. I noticed that there were some people who were awfully upset at the fact that they they felt the person who wrote the title to the video that they're using clickbait. And it's like, oh my God, this is monstrosity. I mean, like literally, they was really speaking <laughs> like that. This is the lowest of the low. I can't believe it. And I'm like, first of all, Bitch, calm down. It's Pornhub. Calm down. <laughs> calm down. Anyway. Then, I'm like, they use clickbait all the time. Not just them. A lot of you see it everywhere. All across the internet. That's what they use to lead you into looking at whatever they uh, want you to look at. But then, another thing I noticed... Something I tell a lot of people, especially the brown motherfuckers, that some of them don't be listening to when I be telling them certain things. Let me tell you something. Seen some really negative, nasty comments. Not the, oh, I can't believe they use clickbait. They lure me in here to watch their video that didn't have nothing to do with what the title said. Uh, no, I seen some, some real negative kind of, uh, racist comments and I was like hmm I find that to be quite interesting because I noticed that you follow the link here knowing you see what the video still picture looks like and you seen the words you was like ooh and you seen the pictures and you was like oh yeah and then you decide to click on it but then when you watch the video because that's the only way you're going to find out if they're actually doing what the title says or not you sat there and watched it. You understand what I'm saying? And then realized, damn it, I didn't see what that title said. Now they're all types of niggers and all kinds of stuff like that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do you know what that makes you? I'm just saying. Just like, what does it make me? I'm watching porn. A porn watcher. Well, what do you think it makes you when you go on the porn channels and then you get mad at the people? Because you didn't see what the title said. Now you call them all types of Negroes and stuff. I guess that makes you a Negro lover. <laughs> now the reason why I, I said that there's some brown folks that don't seem to understand this. When I tell them certain things. Um, th because I, this is what I run across. And uh, sometimes people just don't want to believe it's it's um it's a word I, I have run across watching some videos of some like professors and um uh, you know um psychologists and things like that because i watched they their uh their, their, um i don't know what they be at conventions and dissertations and all that shit the point is is that they call it cognitive dissonance it's, it's kind of like you know there's shit on that stick in the backyard but every time people say, we, we got to have to get rid of that shit on the stick. And you're like, oh shit, on a stick? And you, they like, look out the window. And you steady looking out the window with them. And you're like, no, there ain't no shit on the stick. And they're like, dude, there's shit on a stick. There's a stick out there with shit on it. And you're still c claiming that there's no shit on the stick. But cognitive dissonance. But I mean, you can take it for how you want to.